This may be controversial, but it's impossible to lose money in the stock market. Is that clickbaity enough? Is that clickbaity 10 seconds? I hope it is. It wasn't even 10. That's how we get you hooked. Um, blow this up, folks. You're looking at it right now. The $177,000 portfolio. It's big. It's going to be huge. We're talking about the dividends we earned for the month of March. And let me tell you, this was a big month for dividends in this portfolio. So you better stay tuned. You want to see everything we earned if you like dividends like me. And I know you do. Yesterday, obviously, we posted the monthly recap for the entire Every position we own, you need to look at that one if you haven't because we've been performing very well. Um, but let's get into this one so we don't take up too much of your time. Um, yeah, how about it? So when I say big, big month, I'm spoiling it right away. We earned $588 in absolute beautiful dividends this month. Holy smokes. $588, that's above our average, around 490 It's a big month for us and one of the biggest months probably we're going to have of the year. So this is big. Um, I've never been told that in my life that it's big. I'll just tell you that right now. So this is what's important for me. Now, what are we going to do here? I'm going to zoom. What the? I'm going to zoom in just a smidge for you so that way you can see this just as good as I can, okay? Because... For some reason, Schwab, this is, by the way, let me, what was that at? 200%. I don't know why everything's tiny at Schwab. And that's why I use Schwab. It's tiny. It makes me feel better. Um, you know, I'm not compensating for anything. So here's what we're going to do with this one. Uh, we reinvest every dividend we earn, unless it's a special dividend. Can't do that. So what do we do with those? Well, hey, we basically just, if there's a special dividend, I'll mention it. But otherwise... I'm just going to go to the lines like this that just say reinvest shares because that basically means that's when the dividend gets reinvested. So you can kind of see exactly how many shares we're repurchasing with that. So let's get Krakalakin with the Krakatoa. Holy schmoka. Um, doesn't make any sense, but let's get into it, folks. I don't know, Jim. We're going to get started. Starting with $8.53 from Gladstone Capital. Came in at the end of last month, but it's worth mentioning the dividend reinvestment of 8.83 uh, shares there. That one pays monthly, so got the bevy. Uh, Body Armor, Flash IV, Tropical Punch. Showing it to a camera that doesn't exist. I give this one an 8.3. It's a delicious beverage. You should consider buying it. Um, so, yeah. And we're talking about nearly a share a month we're earning here from Gladstone Capital. So really beautiful to see it. Now, then we get into a couple nice ones here. One being a special dividend from Ford. That's right. They paid a special dividend this month, um, which equated to 29 points. I don't need to say that. $29.71. There's no point. Don't need to mention it. Well, I guess there is, technically, but $29.71 in terms of special dividend. Now, the normal dividend here, we did reinvest for 1.92 shares. It was $24.76, so pretty nice there, actually, too. The normal dividend and special combined, we're talking about a solid $54. Beautiful to see it. So, really, $55, when you include cents there. So, $55 bucks we earned from Ford this month alone, so pretty big. Um Intel, talking about not big. This is more of a me-sized dividend, as the ladies would say. Uh, $2.10, only 0 .04 shares reinvested. Nothing to really talk about there. Um, Intel, you, you kind of can suck on these every day of the week, uh, if you'd like, because you're, you're screwing me over lately. Big, big day here on the 6th, actually, as you can see. Um, a lot of divvies came in, so let's get into the reinvestment, which happened the next day. Starting with JEPQ, our monthly dividend ETF that we own. One of several, folks. One of, ladies and gentlemen, uh, one of several. We own a lot. Uh, $12.15. 0. 0.22 shares reinvested. I mean, nothing crazy there. I mean, it's you know about a $2,000 position. To get 0. 0.22 shares in a month is, is actually makes you pretty happy because the share price has been going up too with the NASDAQ. Something about this mouse, man. I'm addicted to the right clicking. You're talking about, I mean, I feel like Hunter Biden when he sees a bag of white powder. Whenever I see this right mouse button, I go a little crazy, folks. A little bit crazy. JEPI, the JP Morgan Premium Income ETF, 
$14.96 from them. It reinvests for 0. 0.26 shares. Hey, not too bad, 14 buck Aroonies. Hercules Capital paid what we might call a little bit of a fatty. They also paid a special dividend. I need to mention it. It was kind of a you know smaller one, but they do pay a supplemental pretty often, actually, to their uh, normal dividend when they have extra cash, uh, which is pretty much every month, but anyways, or every every quarter, I should say, $9.33 in special dividend, but then the normal dividend was a pretty large one. I mean, we're talking about um, of a Prince Fielder-ish size, $46.63, not quite the biggest of the big, but he's pretty large, no doubt, um, so $46.63 invested for 0.2, 2.5 shares reinvested. Pretty nice, hey, earning 2.5 shares. Uh, you know, that one every quarter. I mean, shoot, we're talking about, you know, 10 shares a year even. It's not it doesn't necessarily seem like much, but it adds up. It really does. That's that snowball, baby. And we're going to talk, and I'm talking about a snowball when it's it's 70 degrees outside, folks. I'm talking about snowballs in here. I'm losing my mind. Um, it's because this chill beverage from Body Armor Flash IV, Tropical Punch flavored, Sends me to a tropical paradise where there is no snow, but I'm so chill. You never know. Target. $13.73 from Target. That's okay. 0 0.08 shares reinvested. I'm, you know, happy to have it. I enjoy when I get a dividend, no doubt. IBM, again, really in it for the share price there, but I'm happy to have the dividend it pays, too. $12.24. Uh, big, big share price, so it doesn't really equate to a lot. 0 0.06 shares. Uh, then we've got uh, Microsoft uh, paid a dividend eight dollars fifty seven cents. Obviously, barely doing anything because it's such a big old big old share price. Um, I don't even know what I just said there. It's hard to even fathom it. Point zero two zero two. A little satisfying there. Really wish we could have a two there. Obviously, that'd have to be a a big big dividend if that was going to be the case. Um, yeah, I mean we're, we're we're talking it'd have to be a you know eight hundred something dollar dividend. But hey. Uh, well, if we did the math, actually, there would actually really have to be about an $850 dividend and 13 cents to equate to this uh, this line here. Just in case you were curious, I did the math for you just now in my head, and I bet it's pretty close. Um, so that was that. The 15th is always a big, big day for us because why our monthlies pay that time? And we got a little certain extra one. From a you know one we kind of enjoy. Anyways, we start with Apple Hospitality. We'll get to that. Don't you worry. Apple Hospitality uh, paid nine dollars fifty six cents. Again, it's a consistent monthly payer, eight cents a, a month. Um, let me see if you can. You probably heard that one. I'll tell you that right now. And I not very apologetic. Uh, you got to do what you got to do when you're in paradise, folks. Thanks to you already know what this beverage. Uh, $9.56 from Apple. Yeah, again, it's pretty nice every month. 0.59 shares reinvested. Hey, not not unhappy, that's for sure. A Realty Income does pay monthly as well, the monthly dividend company, in fact. Um, $16.73. Um, that's a 0 0.32 shares reinvested. Hey, you know, not too bad either. Main Street Capital also pays monthly. That's right. We got This is our monthly payers, baby. They pay on the 15th. Um, 0.26 shares reinvested. Nothing crazy, but we take it. We're pretty happy with that. Um, SWVXX, couple you know reinvestments here. Don't know why they split them up real weird, but anyways, uh, you know about uh, three dollars uh, one cent. They're not about it. It's exactly three dollars one cent. Some people say I'm pretty good with the math, and I am. You know, I do it myself. Who needs it? Um, dogs getting angry at, at nothing. But then you look at this. Holy smokes, folks. This is what we call a Lizzo of a dividend. It's a Lizzo nearly breaking the ground when it walks. If this thing were to fall off the bed, the whole house might collapse. $98.44 pays quarterly, by the way, but look at this. 7.6 shares reinvested. Holy freaking smokes. Absolutely crazy. I don't know how it's possible, man. That's, that's just a fat dividend. Sorry, don't mind me. Anyways, Lizzo just stepped into my house, nearly broke it, man. Nearly stepped through the floor. Um, 
Then we get uh, not as, but anyway, look at that. Every quarter, 7.6 shares. What the freak? That's a true snowball. Next dividend we earn from this is going to be over 100 freaking bucks, dude. That's that's going to be, I mean, we might tear up from Lizzo. We might be going to the elephant territory, folks. Anything over 100, are we calling an elephant nowadays? I don't know. I don't know. Some millionaires are looking at this and saying, $100 dividend, that's for children. It's not for children. You're a child. F you. Stanley Black & Decker. $8.49. Now we get back into kind of the more lame ones here. 0 0.09. We got spoiled by a beautiful one right here. Um, not Lizzo. Not beautiful, by the way. No matter what they want you to say. They don't... It's not... That big isn't beautiful, folks. I'm just telling you that right now. Look, the media doesn't want to tell you it. They don't. I'm going to tell you it. Prospect Capital... $20.32 a share. I've got a special mood going on today. Some may say I need to stop. There's issues. There's big issues today. It really is. $3. Nope, nope. 3.7 shares reinvested. This one pays monthly as well. So again, this one, holy smokes. Can you guys do the math here? Let's see you. Multiply that by 12 because that's 12 months out of the year. I earned it 12 months out of the year. That's right. I know you did the math and we're talking about a freaking juicy... You know, okay, let's let's be honest. I didn't I didn't I didn't do the math well enough. But we're talking about about a forty three shares every year from prospect capital alone. Is that possible? Yes it is. The math says so right here. So so suck on it. Shove your TI eighty where the sun don't shine if you don't know how to use it. Um VYM Vanguard, uh this high dividend yield ETF. You know, not the, nothing crazy here out of this position. It's only a thousand bucks of a position, anyways. But we got eleven dollar fifty seven cent dividend, point zero nine shares reinvested. Um, uh, then we got SPYD, another one of our ETFs here, eleven dollars forty eight cents, point two eight reinvested. Heck yeah, we'll take it all day. Uh, a couple more coming in here on the twenty first. We've got Home Depot with six dollars eighty eight cents. Um, really, you know, pretty small position, so it doesn't equate to a lot. 0 0.01 shares reinvested. I'm not even going to talk about, you know, like, like once we get into the the thousandths, uh, the thousandths, we don't need to mention that. Um, it, it, that's just getting a little bit too pedantic, folks. 227. You didn't understand. You didn't understand the vocabulary was this 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 fantastic. Um, I'm quite verbose, as some might say. Um, some might say also ver gross based off of the comments I've made today, if you know what I'm saying. Ka ching ching. Uh, SPYG to, what was that noise? Is that like knives clinking? Ching ching. No, that's, I can't, no, that's, that's offensive. I, what I just said there, I apologize. Um, I didn't replace one of the eyes with an O though. So that's, that's good at least. Uh, 227. 0 0.03 shares reinvested. Is this thing blowing up or is it going to blow up my channel? Because, um, you know, it's going to get canceled. Qualcomm, 0 0.04 shares reinvested off of $7.38. Not too bad. A couple more coming in on 322. A couple of our monthly dividend ETFs. SPHD to start. $6.72. $6. Make you holla. I think I said the, the dollar instead of the dollar, so I messed that one up big time. 0.15 shares reinvested on that bad boy. We'll take it all day, every day, and Sunday. Um, which Sunday's Easter. Happy Easter, folks. Blessed day. You better be you better be going where you know you should be going. That's right, I told you. You're going to church on Sunday. Um uh, closed on Sunday. You my Chick-fil-A. That's Kanye West. Uh, I made him famous. $16.79 from KBWD, one of our monthly payers. That's right. A, a share a month? Oh, that's right. That You saw it correctly. That's what's happening. KBWY, another one of our monthly paying ETFs. $11.14. Um, kind of the you know smaller of the two there. 0.63 shares reinvested. Um, we'll take it, no doubt. Uh, we got a pretty nice one here from, uh, you know, the 25th to the 26th. Some, some good ones paid here. Uh, SCHD to start off the list here, $28.93, 0.36 shares reinvested. Happy to have that one, our biggest ETF, and, you know, paid a pretty good dividend here for us. Texas Roadhouse, $6.16, pretty good. Um, that's right. Meta Platforms, the first ever 
dividend from Meta Platforms, and we reinvested that B, baby. We reinvested that B because we love it. Almost threw up. Almost threw up because I'm just so elated. 16 bucks, man. 16 bucks. That's pretty good, man. We had 32 shares at 50 cents a share. I could have done the math. Even you could have done the math with that TI-80 sticking underneath your... Not saying it. Not saying it, folks. 0.03 shares reinvested. SCHX, $7.47. 0.12 shares reinvested. Oh, baby. Uh, QILD, one of our monthly paying ETFs. Again, we got a few of them. Uh, I told you we did, and I wasn't lying. Quit telling me I'm lying. Eight dollars ninety-two cents. Point two one shares reinvested. Tempted to mention the thousandth on that one because it's darn close, but could have rounded up, but I didn't. I'm not going to be dishonest with you. I don't round up. I'm telling you the utter truth. Speaking of twelve dollars paid from QILD, I just rounded up one penny. Uh, that's probably the only time I would round up for the Ronald McDonald charity whenever I go to McDonald's is if it's one cent. Um, quit asking me to round up every time. I actually do round up every time. I'm always peer pressured and I round up every single time. Even if it's 12.01 the total, I do round up to 13. I'm peer pressured into it. I feel like if I say no, I'm going to be judged by that McDonald's employee making $15 an hour, probably you know 18 years old. They're going to judge me and I don't want that in my life. You know, what happens if down the road I'm in a car crash with somebody, this 18-year-old from McDonald's has the ability to stop and save my life, but he, well, he doesn't because he works for McDonald's. Anyways, hypothetically, he sees my face and this scumbag didn't pay 12 cents to the McDonald Ronald McDonald charity house in which six cents went to the organization of McDonald's. I'm not saving him. And he drives by, he keeps driving, watching me with my legs split in half, arm cut off because of the crash, head dangling. I'm probably dead at that point already. Anyways, um, where was I? I blacked out for a second. MGC, the Vanguard Mega Cap ETF, we're back, baby. $4.12. Uh, really not much here. 0 0.02 shares reinvested. Tapestry, pretty nice. Uh oh, I clipped this. Clipped? I clipped. I don't know, I'm going to record a clip on you man 360 no scope eleven dollars eight cents tapestry um the mcdonald's employee is gonna freaking put a clip on me man i'm gonna be going live on on live leak or something i don't think that's how it works i'm gonna go viral on live leak once he drives past me after i forgot to donate uh 0 0.244 0 0.24 shares reinvested for tapestry off eleven dollars eight cents um we got a couple kind of stragglers to wrap up the month here on the 28th or i guess they paid the 27th sorry uh, starting with VFH, uh, VFH paid, oh, Main Street, by the way, special dividend of 1515. Got to mention it, special dividend, baby. That's not going to reinvest. They don't do that, but it's happy. To, I'm happy to have it. Um, makes me feel special, that's for sure. 495, um, kind of a satisfying dividend amount. I don't know why. It, it shouldn't be, but it is. 0 0.04 shares reinvested for VFH, another one of our dividend-paying ETFs. NVIDIA, this one, unfortunately, I, I not only have to tell you the thousandth, I have to tell you the ten thousandth position here. Um, <coughs> oh, gosh. Um, one, one, th or three one-thousandths of a penny. Three one-thousandths of a penny is what I got. Uh, oh, sorry, I'm just kidding. Three one-thousandths of a share reinvested. I apologize. Wait. Three ten thousandths of a share reinvested. I'm, you know, look, the brain, I was bold, I was bold, 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 I've lost all thought. It's gone. It's gone. 24 cents we got paid. A dollar forty from Wisdom Tree U.S. Small Cap Dividend ETF. Tiny position here. One dollar forty cents was point zero four three shares. Nothing crazy. Uh, Three dollars forty two cents from IVV. The iShares Core S and P five hundred ETF. Point zero zero six five. I mentioned it because it wasn't even point zero one. What a shame. Um, and then finally, Gilead Sciences at twelve twenty four. Uh, twelve dollars twenty four cents reinvest for point one six five nine. Oh baby, I mentioned all of them. That's what I got for you. Sug on D's. I'm getting banned today, folks. I'm feeling a little crazy. I don't know. I'm feeling a little crazy today. The Batman. <laughs>